Good day, fellow learners. Once again, this is your mentor here, Fact Check by Ray Gapus, joining you for case number 27 for our next generation, NCLEX RN. And before we start our discussions, I'd like to ask you to join us in this mission. Our goal is to provide free NCLEX RN application review to 100 nurses. We've been able to do that successfully in the past two years. For 2024, we've increased that actually to 300. And for next year, our target is to provide 500 scholarships for the whole year. To help us achieve this, just watch and finish the ads in our videos. And please don't skip. And if you happen to share this video to at least 10 of your friends, we will pray for your success. Thank you in advance. So we actually have a promo, get a free review from us if you process your NTEX RN application with ITAPS GAPUS. And for the upcoming Christmas special promo, which is valid until December 8, 2024, you get a 50% discount for our test preparations program for the NCLEX RN. And that's only valid until December 8, 2024. Let me start also by sharing this public advisory that Dr. Ray Gapus, that's me, and the mentors of the Ray Gapus system are not part of another center named Gapus Review or Gapus Review Academy. So if you want to avail of our full package in the Ray Gapus traditional quality, high quality review, please do look for my full name, Ray A. Gapus Review System. And I'd like to share with you the success story of one of our pastors, Christina de la Merced Paredes. And she says, success is no accident. It is hard work, perseverance, learning, studying, sacrifice, and most of all, love of what you are doing or learning to do. And this is what she says, Ray Gapus, thank you, Sir Ray. I will not be able to have this, okay, uh, without your help. You're one of the people who motivate me and help me to achieve this goal. Thank you so much, sir. Proud to be a Gapus baby. And she's now a registered nurse in the state of Illinois. Now on to case number 27, we're going to be talking about frostbite, okay? But before we do so, let me share this inspiring story of a lady who eventually passed, not after failing the test. So here's the story of Maria Rosario Corpus Soriano, and she says, Matthew 9, 29, because of, you, of your faith, it will happen. Here's her success recipe, two boot camps, she attended two boot camps that's being done in the summer capital of the country in Baguio City. One comprehensive review, one quick fix, and one failure later. I finally passed my NCLEX exam at number 88. Wow, quite a fit. I had to include my failure in this testimony because honestly, that failure was the biggest plot twist of my entire NCLEX journey. Does it mean the review system does not work? No. It just spoke volumes that there is no universal way to success. I agree, Madam Maria Rosario. We must map our own path, make our own game plan, and carry it out the baddest as possible way we can. I heard of testimonies like reading NCLEX 311 several times, joining several comprehensive review, bootcamp and quick fix review, and listening to YouTube lectures while doing house chores. I tried my 50-year-old body, ADHD brain, and menopausal mood, not to mention my motherhood load were all acting up. Then I failed in my first try of the exam, and that failure impacted on me in more ways than one. That failure demotivated me. It made me question my capabilities and get intimidated by other people's wins. Instead of learning the lessons of my defeat, that failure humbled me. It taught me that the force will not always be with me, that there are times when my weaknesses will outweigh my strengths, times when my best effort will not be enough. Most of all, that, that failure awakened my faith. It is not pure chance that I am with the Ray Gapus Review System. I believe God led me there to experience the passion of the mentors in teaching. Thank you so much for the very kind words. And I think your experience spoke volumes of what we do in a very passionate way to experience the review system. So I decided to figure out ways on how the RAGRS would work best for me. I sorted the topics in NPEX 311, 
wrote them in two different notebooks, Drugs and Diseases. I sat and fervently watched Sir Ray's YouTube videos and wrote the concepts in a third notebook I labeled as cases. I must say, MCLEX311 and YouTube videos became my best friends. Thank you so much. I read topics from NCLEX 311 three times. I read it the first time, uninterrupted. Second, when I write it down on my notebook. Third, when I read what I have written. The same with the YouTube videos. I watch it the first time, uninterrupted. Second, when I need to pause and play while writing in my notebook. I play it the third time, uninterrupted, while I go over my notes. I must say the functional concept works a lot like a compass. That's very unique to the Ray Gapa system. You don't see it in any test preparations program around the world. It's only with the Ray Gapa system. That's the way to pass a test, functional concepts way. Helping us to navigate through complex topics. I took the exam the second time and passed. Thank you so much, Ray. You inspire me a lot kasi napaka-reachable mo. Approachable is an understatement. Thank you. Just don't ask me about class schedules, class. I'm no good at numbers. Ask me what programs you want, how to study. Ask me anything except schedules. That's the job of our front desk officers at the office. Okay? Sabi niya, approachable is an understatement. The rega puska, pero andyan ka lang para sa aming lahat. She felt that I'm always there for them. Okay, thank you so much for these very kind words. Wala kang star complex. Of course, why would I? I'm just an ordinary person that you get to bump into when you're there out on the streets. Okay? Thank you, sir. Mahal ka namin. Sana bigyan ka pa ng mahabang buhay para marami ka pang matulungan sa pag-abot ng pangarap. God bless you always, sir. To all the mentors, hindi po matatawaran yung passion ninyo to help all of us make our dreams come true. Thank you for giving us the gift towards a better life for ourselves. The greed, rather. Towards a better life for ourselves and our family. God bless the whole RAGRS team. Above all, thank you, God. Through all this, it is really you, not me. She also processed her papers through ITAPS Gapos. We do it at a more affordable cost because our packages starts at 45000 including a free review program. Okay? So, on to our topic for today. When you say frostbite, now this is common to those who usually guide people to go mountain climbing. Like, for example, at Mount Everest, you see a lot of Sherpa. Okay? These are the guides for those who love to explore Mount Everest. That's the highest um, mountain in the world. Okay, so frostbite refers to tissue destruction resulting from prolonged cold exposure and freezing. Now, it begins at temperature below negative 0.55 degrees centigrade, or that's equivalent to 31 degrees Fahrenheit. So at this point, you will feel the signs and symptoms and would go through the different degrees of frostbite, which we're going to discuss as we move along. Okay, so frostbite actually affects the fingers, notice that these are distal parts of the body, the toes, the nose, the cheeks, the chin, and of course the ears, including the lips. Okay, so the first degree or frost nip of a frostbite is characterized by red or blotchy discolored skin with numbness and tingling. Now, numbness and tingling would mean that there's no beginning nerve damage in that area. That's a first degree. Okay, frost nip. Okay, second degree or the superficial um, frostbite is characterized as bluish or purplish warm skin with blisters. Once again, second degree frostbite, you see blisters. Okay, and then third degree or severe frostbite, the skin is characterized as blackened and hard skin due to freezing of deep tissues. Now, this is where there's loss of sensation um, that could probably be due to the damage to the peripheral nerve endings. Okay, treatment of frostbite includes protect the skin from cold. So we need to rewarm the skin, but we have to do that without necessarily worsening the injury. Then rubbing, bending, stretching must be avoided as it could potentially put a strain on the damaged tissues of the distal part of the body. 
open flame exposure must be avoided as the sensation of the damaged skin could usually be impaired. And definitely, open flame exposure could worsen the damage. And then, soak in warm water. The temperature should be 98 degrees Fahrenheit to 108 degrees Fahrenheit. The important thing to remember here is that we need to rewarm the area that has suffered from frostbite. Okay, so let me share with you NCLEX 311 before we use what we have discussed to answer a case. And here's one of those who use it. Complete package ang aking exam, pero dahil isinapuso ko yung 311 book mo, sir. And yung new version ng 311, you have it here on our screen. Binasa ko araw-araw ang aking exam. Kaya po ako nakapasa. So here's case number 27, a 35-year-old mountaineer comes to the emergency department with some skin of the left foot, pale and reddish, with blisters, that's a key word, filled with milky white fluid, with swelling, pain, and numbness. The nurse should in implement interventions related to which degree of frostbite. Now, the fact that you have blisters, this is actually second degree, okay? There's no fourth degree, okay? The most severe one is third degree, where the skin looks black, okay? When there's tingling and numbness, that's usually first degree. So the answer here, second degree. Okay, so join our hundreds and thousands of pastors from more than 30 countries worldwide who are using the Ray Gapus system. Okay, and of course, we teach you how to study with technology because at the Ray Gapus system, our tools are published by world renowned publishers. We have our own learning management system that covers all the subjects of the and next generation NCLEX are in test, and of course. Our environment is very conducive. We limit the number of students per class. And we have here our own simulation room. So I'd like to invite you to our NCLEX RN Flex, the most flexible test prep class for NCLEX RN, your choice of live face-to-face -face class, virtual class, on-demand and limited video recorded lessons, a QBank entry books, and gen strategies and sample questions. Take note. The fee starts at 3499 including the three books, plus my strategies. I'll see you. Once again, this is your mentor, your fact check by the Ray Gapu, saying thank you and see you in our next video. Take care. Have a blessed day ahead.